Hello and welcome to HealthWise. I'm Jennifer Slimko. Your best defense against foodborne illness can be as close as your produce aisle. That's right. Eating more dietary fiber helps the good bacteria in your stomach resist bad bacteria such as E. coli. We have science and nutrition expert Jeff Leach here today to discuss the importance of this link. Probiotics are live bacteria that you get in yogurt and other milk products. And then prebiotics are food for the probiotics. So prebiotics are special because they selectively stimulate the growth of two very important bacteria in the human body. And they occur naturally in things like garlic, onion, leek, asparagus, artichoke, bananas. And if you'll eat these prebiotic dietary fibers, you'll selectively grow these very, very important bacteria in your gastrointestinal tract, which have been shown in laboratory settings and in human studies to specifically fight off foodborne pathogens. Consumers need to understand in order to fortify their immune systems, basically, or fortify their gut bugs to these pathogens, they need to feed them. And so they need to eat now more than ever more dietary fiber. Our ancestors consumed 50, 75, up to and often greater than 100 grams a day of dietary fiber. The average American today eats 12. So if you want to protect yourself at home, if you want to protect your family and your friends, Talk to people about eating more dietary fiber and look for ways to incorporate it into your lifestyle. And so rather than run from spinach, you want to run to it. You should try to focus on getting 10 to 15 different varieties of fruits and vegetables and whole grains a week. If you can put that number to 25 or 30, you'll reduce your risk to pathogens, foodborne pathogens specifically. To find out more about the importance of dietary fiber, visit the Dole Nutrition Institute at donutrition.com. For HealthWise, I'm Jennifer Slimko, wishing you good health, and I'll see you next time.